Hey, welcome back to the channel. I'm camoed up, y'all. I'm excited about this. Now, it is Velvet Weekend, private property. You can hunt velvet bucks. And um, I'm going at this blindsided. I haven't even, I haven't been out to the woods since last uh, hunting season. I don't know what it looks like. I don't, I don't even have cameras out. So we're gonna just go out there and sit and <laughs> see if something comes in. I mean, I'll, I'll be happy to put anything on film, but maybe we just get lucky and you know, something good walks in. They haven't been hunted, you know, since hunting season. So they're not pressured. They're just, they're just, you know, making their way around and feeding on what's on the ground. So. Uh, like I said, this year I haven't done nothing. I haven't. Uh, the only thing I did was pull. I pulled the camera out uh, out of the woods. Other than that, everything's been the same since. So, hang tight. <laughs> Just heard a gunshot. A gunshot is not good. It's bow only for velvet. And I just heard a gunshot. All right, y'all. Still got some daylight, but <clears throat> it's getting dark in the woods, so got on out of there. Again, no luck today, but we got tomorrow still, and then that's it. And then it closes down for a little while, so after tomorrow, maybe we'll get some cameras out. And maybe throw some corn out just to see what's on property, because we can't hunt on corn but we can throw it out just to see what's on property still um we did have somebody pretty close shoot at shoot not shoot at us but shoot like 20 times so and then hopefully the camera caught the what was behind us i've never i've sat in this spot for like four years and i've never had a deer come in behind me at this spot so, kind of a first, um, but I'm hoping the camera at least heard heard it, heard it run off, whatever. But anyway, we're gonna head back to the house. See what Mama C is doing. I think she she's seen more deer than I did. We'll throw that little clip in. She was coming home and spotted some deer on the highway. So she had to come to a complete stop just for them to cross the road. I got the wife with me today. Going back out there. We got today and tomorrow. We got church in the morning, so we didn't wanna we didn't get up this morning to come out here. We're just gonna go afternoon time. Anyway. 
We know Tom and Jerry's there. They'll probably be there again today. We just need that. We just need some deer on camera. I mean, I'd like to get a good velvet buck, but I'd like to get some deer on camera. What you think? Yeah. And be nice. Jeez, that's too close. Too close. All right, y'all. We hit it to the woods. We'll see you. We'll see you. It's uh, 406 and 83 degrees. It's another hot one. All right. We're walking to the to the blind. We're gonna see how long it takes before the gunshots start. How long you think? I don't know. She wasn't out here yesterday, so she didn't get to hear it, but y'all heard it.
All right, y'all. As disappointing this is, <laughs> I overshot that buck. I don't know how I did it, but I did it. We played the video over slow-mo. It looks like I overshot him. I couldn't find the arrow. Couldn't find the blood. Uh, but we did. We played it over and over and over. And like it didn't have no... Like you can hear it hit maybe a stick or tree or something. But not a deer. So It's heartbreaking. It's heartbreaking. It's, it's, it's cool but heartbreaking. It's heartbreaking because... I missed probably the biggest deer in my life so far. It was cool because, again, we had, I just come out here and sat for velvet. We didn't have no cameras, no nothing out here, just to even see what we had on property. So we didn't even know if we was gonna see anything, but um, comment down below if you bow hunt, what kind of arrows y'all use that y'all find y'all's arrows? Cause I looked all over for it just to see it. Couldn't find the arrow. <laughs> I walked all around. We couldn't find no arrow, no blood, no nothing. I know I didn't hit him, but still. <laughs> all right, last day of velvet. Now, or the question, the big question is, are we gonna see anything after yesterday? What do you think? I don't know. <laughs> I mean, anything's possible. Yeah. So, yesterday, we got out there. It was about the same time. Sat out there for about an hour and a half, and then just they started just crossing, piling in. And uh, I shot at one, and I went, I don't know, four or five inches above his back, and he never squatted. So I was like, there's no way. We got home. I started shooting and uh, I was like four or five inches high and to the right and I couldn't understand it because I just shot Friday. But anyway, I guess I don't know if I banged it up or whatever or loose, I don't know. But anyway, I got it dialed in yesterday evening. We I shot for what, 30 minutes? Yeah. Yeah, so I got it dialed in. So now the question is, are they gonna come back? We're thinking, I mean, they'll come back. I'm not gonna say they won't, because it was shot with a bow, not a rifle, of course. So it wasn't like the loud bang, you know, whatever, but still it startled them, spooked them, and they took off. Um, so I know they'll come back. We just don't know if they'll come back today. But anyway, I got my lucky hat on. We had a good church service. We had a really good church service. Um, had some really good food after church. We got we got the good Lord above and the and the lucky hat on our side today, so I know one thing we'll see. What? Tom and Jerry. Yeah. <laughs> That's a given. Huh? That's a given. Yeah. So anyway, so we got day one, day two. This is this is it. This is this I blew my chance on my first velvet hunt. But, this is it till September. Yeah, September the twenty ninth. Eight. It's 28 or something like that. So anyway, we're gonna head to the blind and get set up. We'll see y'all out. I hope y'all are being blessed day 